Why is Kenny the most powerful Soul Reaper out there? I hope Yachiru's okay. Don't mess with her. Kenny's gonna be pissed. Oh my god, this dude looks like he's on fentanyl. <laughs> Stern Ritter V. <laughs> Like, she's hitting him, but it's not registering. Oh, Yachiru, no! What the heck? It's like he can't be perceived. Erases his existence. That's actually crazy powerful. It's like he exists, but he doesn't. That is crazy looking. He really can't be perceived. He just vanishes and reappears. She can like sense him almost. What do you mean you don't know if he's a friend or foe? Why would he be a friend? You clearly don't know him. Isane, come on. She trusts her tingles. Oh, there's a Zanpakuto. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, she got him. Wait, how did she do that if he can't be perceived? Whoa. It's a copycat? Oh, that's fascinating. Oh, snap! What are those? <laughs> Yo, I love Gayashiru. She is so freaking funny. <laughs> Look at her Shikai go. <laughs> I wonder what her Bankai is like. If she can ever unlock one. <laughs> she is such a funny match for Kenny. Uh oh. Who showed up? Wait, who is that? Is this another one of the Quincy's? Who's the, who's the punk in the hood? And why did he just take out one of the, his own Stern Ritters? Gremmy! And what can he do? He basically just exploded him! He turned into just nothing! He imploded! And he just got through the barrier just like that! Come on, Yachiru! Oh my god, her arm! He completely broke it! Is his, are his powers like somehow imagination? That's so broken. That's so broken. He imagined that she was that brittle. Kenny! Oh, he's here just in time. Let's go, let this punk know. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is the first time Isane is going to find out. Oh, my God. Poor Isane. That's so devastating. Oh, my God. Wait. 
Yep. He's achieved that title now and surpassed it. <laughs> this bastard. Nah, this dude's about to be like the, the strongest one out of everybody. Because he basically has unlimited powers. He can do whatever he wants. The visionary. Oh, that's cool. Oh my god. And he doesn't believe that Kenny can cut him. He imagined that his sword was either like not strong at all or that his own body was impenetrable. But even then, Kenny gets a slice in. <laughs> Yo, that's not gonna work on Kenny. You gotta come up with some other tricks. He is such a menace. Your puny imagination. Because he's Kenpachi, baby. It's that simple. I am the edge. Let's go. And he can regenerate himself. He can heal. That's so crazy. There's got to be a way around this, though. He's got to, like, break his will. Look, it's, a, it's an incredibly broken power, and in the hands of somebody else, it might be the most powerful ability in the series. But when you're face-to-face -face with Kenny, anything is possible. That's so foul. Oh, there's the music again. Come on, Kenny. Oh my god, he trapped him in like a bubble. Like a water sphere. This is insane. Yachiru! But now she's back to normal. So maybe he can only focus on a couple of different things at a time. Is he really the strongest Quincy? And that's perfect for Kenny. Said, focus on me. I wonder if he's going to unlock any of that, that hidden power that's within Kenny. This is the first time he's been challenged. Oh, uh, yo, yo, he's got the whole armory. <laughs> what in the world is this? Why does, like, everyone the Soul Reapers fight have, like, guns and heavy machinery? Meanwhile, they're out here with swords. He gets off on this, too. On the, on being in battle. And he still slices right through him. Oh, my God. Oh, he used his own line against him. Oh, big time slice. Let's go. Why is Kenny the most powerful Soul Reaper out there? This dude is so unstoppable. Dude's imagination can't even stop Kenny's sword. That self-doubt is creeping in. Look at that. He's so shook. Because if he gets broken like that, then he's going to give in. Dude can make shadow clones too. I guess he can do anything he wants. Oh my god. That, that dude. That was a product of his imagination. He's unreal. 
Gremmy is nuts. This dude's dropping meteors like he's Madara. <laughs> this is this is absurd. This is like a Naruto ripoff. <laughs> Bro, Kenny, dude, if Kenny stops a meteor. Bro, Kenny is built different. This man is about to stop a meteor from hitting the Serate. And, and, and this site just excites him even more. Like, he likes to be told that. He likes to be doubted. So he can flex on everybody. <laughs> Only this man, Kenny, jumps right into a meteor. About to slice this shit in half. Yo, nah, nobody mess with Kenny. He, he is up here. Everybody else is in the basement, man. He's the most powerful character in this show. I'm sorry. Like, if you don't mess with Kenny, I don't mess with you. It's that simple. Dude is a god. Oh, my God. Is this the power he unlocked from defeating Unohana? His Zanpakuto turned into, like, a giant cleaver. He is the executioner. Oh, now he's just making a ton of copies. He's still gonna cut through them. Without form? Oh my god, that's so broken. That's so broken! How, how is he going to survive this? Dude can cut through space and time! <laughs> what the heck? Oh my god, he put bombs on himself. This doesn't even feel like it's a battle in Bleach. This feels like it's like in some other show. There's so many crazy things happening. He didn't even puncture him. <laughs> Kenny is a demon. <laughs> Yo, these battles have been so crazy. He's like busting apart at the seams. Oh my god, there it is. He did this to himself psychologically. Ken Kenny solos like every anime universe. I'm sorry. But he's still alive. Is he really done though? What the hell? Did he just like shoot his brain out? What is happening? His body isn't real? Are you serious? This is nutty. Grammy's just gonna phase away also. That's what happens when you step up to Kenny. You get crushed like a bug. You guys, that was one of the craziest Bleach episodes I feel like we've seen. That felt like a fever dream to me. Like, because of Gremmy's powers and abilities, that didn't even really feel like I was just watching Bleach right now. Like, he pulled out the, all the guns. He pulled out the armory on my guy. Like, he was using all types of crazy powers. Summoned lava. Like, trapped him in water. Like, rose that battlefield up. He sent, he sent Kenny to space! And it still wasn't enough. Like... <laughs> I don't know what to tell you anymore. Like, Kenny solos everybody. He solos the entire Jujutsu Kaisen universe. He can take on Goku as far as I'm concerned. Like, this man is the, the most powerful anime character I've ever freaking seen, dude. Like, nothing can stop him. And he still does not even have a Bankai. We don't even know if he can unlock a Bankai, but he still hasn't even been pushed to that point. It was so sick to see his Zanpakuto evolve into just that giant axe cleaver thing and just 
swinging that all at Grimey, just slicing him to no end. His mind couldn't keep up and neither could his body. And ultimately those two things both failed him in this fight. Like Kenny is, Kenny as soon as he like popped on screen, he became one of my favorite Bleach characters. And this goes to show you why, because his power levels are just straight up off the charts, man. Like he is literally superhuman. He is a monster, he is a demon. Nothing can stop this dude. Bleach keeps on bringing the hype, you guys. And if you guys enjoyed this one, let me know what you thought of this one down in the comment section down below. And as always, y'all, I mean the world to me if you would like and subscribe, as it would help me out a ton. But until next time, y'all, take care. Have yourselves a great day, everybody. Peace.